St. Matthew chapter 21, verse 21. Yahweh Shah answered and said unto them, Verily I say unto you, If ye have faith, and doubt not, you should not only do this which is done to the fig tree, but also if ye shall say unto this mountain, Be thou removed, and be thou cast into the sea, it shall be done. And all things whatsoever ye shall ask in prayer, believing, ye shall receive. Barakatha Yahweh, Barakatha Yahweh Shai, Barakatha Yahweh, Barakatha Yahweh Shai, Barakatha Yahweh, Barakatha Yahweh Shai. Dubana said the elders of Israel, which are the elders of Great Millstone, the elders of Har, Gabar, Rakah, Ariam, live on down, and honors and blessings to the elect. We are the elect, okay? And, and there's no running from it. A lot of, a lot of times, brothers get a little too uh, modest. They, they'll get a little too too uh, humble and then they also doubt thinking that you're not the elect you're not a man of the most high but because you go off you feel bad when you're around brothers you know what i'm saying this brother man of the lord i'm not you know you had that what was me demon on you you know what i'm saying you letting letting whatever you did weigh you down but you have what i said we should have faith faith and doubt not don't doubt that you're the elect and then it says what's up you 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 ask in prayer and believing you shall receive what is the main thing that we want to receive? The kingdom of heaven. But you also, above everything, above the women, above the slaves, above everything, you just want to be a part of the elect. Like, I just want to make it. You got the brother Tawabi in Chicago. He made a comment, like, as far as the kingdom of heaven, he didn't want to put the cart before the horse. You know, that's the old saying. Basically, he don't want to make it seem like, okay, he wants the blessings of the kingdom, and he don't even know if he's the elect yet, all right? Because it's all about the elect. And you brothers are the elect, man. The, the, the proof is, is that the signs the Lord give you. The Lord give you signs. You'll see 144 on like a car tag, or you will see it in other different places. 144, what does that resonate with your spirit? 144,000. Why does he show you that? You will see chariots up in there. Why did he show you a chariot? You know what I'm saying? And then the, the main thing is, you know, uh, basically, all right, we in this flesh, you can't directly see the most high. But you already know, man, like, you won't see the thing is with brothers, with, with us, with Israel, we are the elect of Israel, you want that certainty. Like, I just gotta know, like, man, I know I'm weak, I'm in this flesh, but man, if I just knew I was the elect, I'd go hard, man. Well, guess what? Through the spirit of the Lord, man, you are the elect, man. You know what I'm saying? Like, I mean, cause you know if the Lord came down right now, he told you, man, you are of my elect. You would go hard in the spirit. Same time, Really, you will be complacent. You will be all relaxed and shit. Like, you don't got to do the work. That's why he didn't tell you directly. But because you will get comfortable, you wouldn't be on fire. But but sometimes, like, not, not knowing that exactly, it just puts you in the faith even harder, okay? That I hope I'm the elect. But you are the elect, man. But the reason why the Lord says things is really, I'm going to show you, is to make you fear. The reason why he don't want you to really know because is to make you fear, all right? And to show you that you ain't you ain't nothing, even though you are the elect. You still, all right, look, little Israelite, you know, humble yourself. Don't get puffed up. Hebrews chapter 10, verse 35. Cast not away, therefore, your confidence, which hath great recompense of reward. For ye have need of patience, that after that ye have done the will of the Most High, Yahweh Bashim Shai, ye might receive the promise. So suddenly you, you might, like maybe. Because with this truth, it's 50-50. It, either you are or you're not, man. But through the spirit of Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, we're going to get a couple more scriptures. If you endure to the end, then you are the elect, man. All right? If you say it's truth, you might receive the promise. The reason why he said might is because to make you fear, man. It's to make you fear, man. All right? Because none of us want to be a castaway. You don't want the Lord to hold on to you. And you bring other brothers in the truth, you preaching good to them, but then you yourself are cast away. You know what I'm saying? He'll have you in truth for a little while. Like, all right. You know what I'm saying? He gonna wake up this brother, he gonna wake up that brother. He gonna do this little lesson, he gonna do that lesson. All right? But now I'm gonna put these demons on him. You don't want that to be you, man. And first of all, man, let me, sh you know, to show you what it's about, because you got these niggas, man. And they, they niggas, man. I-U-I-C. Idiots, uh, idiots under insane clowns. They talk about the fringes, right? The fringes, you know? Well, fringes and burgers with these niggas. 
you know, they cook out Israelites. All right, well, you know, that is in the law, Numbers 15 and 37. But you know what it's really about? It's really about this, man. That's really what it's about. You know, and the brother gave me the shirt, all right? That's, that's really what it's about, man. It's about the name, man. Yahweh by Shimmy Al Shai. That's what's being exalted, not the fringes, man. You fucking niggas, all right? That's what it's about, man. We represent that name. We represent, yeah, we're ambassadors. We represent that name. That name is on us, man. It says that name is in our foreheads, which means it's, it's in our mind, okay? Now, I'm gonna get a couple more scriptures, man. I done wrote a, a lot, but you know, I ain't finna get them all. But basically, um, Matthew 7 and 24. Because see, what Yahweh Shai is looking for, Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai is looking for, he's looking for rock hard faith, man, okay? Rock hard, rock stone cold faith. All right, just like uh, Jake back in the '70s, they used to say solid. You know, we, solid is hard, man. But what, what's got to be solid is your faith, man, and nothing gonna shake you. All right, because when that sifting comes, when that when that wind blows, when that storm comes, you won't you won't be overtaken. All right, because because you rock hard in the faith. Matthew chapter seven, verse twenty-four. Therefore, whosoever hear of these sayings of mine and doeth them, that's the point, doeth them, I will liken him unto a wise man which built, built his house upon a rock. So your foundation is it's on a rock, stone. And the rain descended and the floods came and the winds blew and beat upon that house and it fell not for it was founded upon a rock. So that's the point. That's how we got to be. Rock hard faith. And you can read the rest on your own. Basically, if you're not like that, you, your house going to fall and your house is you, your body, you, yourself. You gonna follow out the truth, man. All right. And the next scripture I'm gonna get is Colossians chapter three, verse twelve. Because what we have to do as the elect, you have to do what the elect would do, man. All right. Colossians chapter three, three and twelve. Put on therefore as the elect of the Most High, holy and beloved, bowels of mercies, kindness, humbleness of mind, meekness, long suffering. Forbearing one another and forgiving one another, if any man have a quarrel against any, even as Yahweh Shah forgave you, so also do ye. And we will forgive Nate Satan if he stopped teaching them false doctrines. The elders will forgive him, man. They won't go, go in on him like they've been going in on him, because y'all think we bullies, man. The elders, the elders in us ain't bullies, man. He going off. Maharaka is going off. Zabak is going off. Basically, you guys don't want to be rebuked, man. All right? That, that's real love. Paul, Paul was getting in people's shit, man. He was getting them churches shit, man. Paul said, the more I love, the less I be loved. Because he was getting on them, man. All right? So put on, as the elect of the Most High, we got to put on the characteristics of the Most High. Give diligence to make your calling and election sure. Okay? And I'm going to get a couple more. Wisdom of Solomon, chapter 3, verse 9. Because what, what you have to know, it's all about the elect, man. All right? Because you have to ask yourself, okay, why are you in this truth? Why are you in this truth? We are in this truth to, to be the elect, okay? All right, I'm going to get two more scriptures and I'm going to close this lesson now. Wisdom of Solomon, chapter 3, verse 9. They that put their trust in him shall understand the truth. So another word for trust is confidence or faith. All right, and it says, And such as be faithful in him shall abide with him. So like, so like it. For such as be faithful and love shall abide with them. For grace and mercy is to his saints, and he hath care for his elect. So that's what it's all about, man. Okay? And I'm going to get one more scripture. All right? Hebrews chapter 11. Because the thing is, you have to believe that you're the elect, man. All right? You got to believe the Lord going to reward you, because the Lord is fair, man. All right? The, the, the Lord is fair. He's not going to give you too much you can't handle. All right? I'm going uh, I'm, to I'm read chapter 6 and then I'm going to jump to 11. Hebrews 6 and uh, 10. For the Most High is not unrighteous to forget your work and labor of love, which ye have shown toward his name, and that ye have ministered to the saints and do minister, that you do the work. And we desire that every one of you do show the same diligence to the full assurance of hope unto the end. So you have to do the same thing until the end, man. But this is Hebrews chapter 11, verse 6, and I'm going to close it out. But without faith, it is impossible to please him. For he that cometh to the Most High must believe that he is. And that's what his name means. And that he is a rewarder of them that diligently seek him. So you got to believe the Lord going to reward you, man. You got to believe that he going to save you out this shit. You got to believe that you the elect. 
and believe you're going to stay in it. And you're going to do it. But at the same time, we had that mind frame. Hey, if, if I'm not, fuck it. I'm all out, man. This is all I got, man. Against all odds, man. Like you had the three brothers. They called Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego. That was the Babylonian names. But they was like, if, if the Most High won't save us, we're still not going to bow down to the image that Nebuchadnezzar set up. So even if the Lord ain't with us, I still ain't finna take that fucking chip, man. Cause we hate this fucking place, man. All right, but with that, this is what it's about. And Lord will, we the Lords, man. Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. All right, we gonna be in the kingdom soon, man. So with that, Barakatayahu, Barakatayahu Shai, Shalom.